John, do you need me to read this slowly? I <laughs> know. Okay. No. John stays up to date on the latest headlines. I just thought I'd give you another second or two. Yeah, thank you. Uh, he likes to share his knowledge of useless information with others. Here he is for another edition of Wiki Who. Wiki Who. Yes, oh, back by popular demand. Uh, after, so popular. After a bit of a break. Uh, okay, so the game works like this. Dean, I believe this is your first time playing. It is. Okay. Oh, so I here. give you uh, the names of three famous people who share the same first name. Okay. Uh, and then I give you a semi obscure factoid, usually from their Wikipedia page. <laughs> and then you have to tell me which one that factoid applies to, which Got one it. it's true about. And I should tell you that not every one of these people gets a factoid chosen. So you can't use mm. the process of elimination when we get down to the final one. Okay? Mm -hmm. Got it. Okay. I'm ready. Round one. Oh, by the way, I should say, we're dealing with the Pauls today. Oh, the Pauls? Your choices are Paul Giamatti, oh. Paul Rudd, uh -huh. and Paul McCartney. I okay. very well in this. Okay. These are all very prominent Pauls. By the way, I chose them because January 1st is Paul Revere's birthday. Oh. Who oh. knew? But he's not on the list. I couldn't find anybody good for December 31st. <laughs> so. Okay, question number one. Which Paul owns a candy shop? Oh. Uh, I'm going to go with Paul McCartney. I want it to be Paul Giamatti. Is that what you're going with? Yeah, Paul yeah, Giamatti? Yeah. yeah. Well, guys, uh, the Beatles sang about rocking horse people eating marshmallow pies. Uh -huh. And they did their fair share of candy, if you oh. will, over the years. Uh -huh. But if Sir Paul owns a candy shop, he's kept it a secret all these years. But mm -hmm. when Ira Guthrie died in 2014, Samuel's Sweet Shop in Rhinebeck, New York, almost closed. Thankfully, actor Jeffrey Dean Morgan and his friend Paul Rudd took oh, it over. And they own it around. to this day and operate it. Wow. Isn't He's that a nice story, Jeffrey though? Dean Morgan? Yeah, and isn't, isn't that such a Paul Rudd way to own a candy yeah, shop? Yeah, 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 yeah. Actually. It's like the nicest way to own one. Okay, question number two. Okay. Which Paul was classmates with Oscar winner Ed Norton and award-winning actor Ron Livingston in college. Ed Norton and Ron Livingston went to college with one of these three Pauls. I'm gonna go with Paul Giamatti. Same, Giamatti. You guys are both going Giamatti. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, well guys, Yale is a very tough school to get into. True. Not saying there was nepotism, but when your dad is the president oh. of the university, that's gotta help. Mm-hmm. But Paul Giamatti has since proven his medal as a top flight yeah. actor, and he was acting with those two. How about that talented class? Yeah, that's yeah. pretty wow. good. Wow. You got Ed Norton, Paul Giamatti, and Ron Livingston. Bet you the free plays that you could check out are really good there. By the way, in case you didn't know, also, uh, Paul Giamatti's dad went on to be the commissioner of baseball. Oh, that's right. Bart Giamatti. Yeah, wow. Bart. Uh -huh. That's right. Okay. Yeah. All, right. All the connections. Final question. Cody, are you two for two right now? Eh, oh, one for one. Oh, so the, the relish is safe. Yeah, relish. There's no relish <laughs> on the line. <laughs> question number three. Which Paul left his fiance after she had a miscarriage? Oh, I want to slap this, Paul. I don't want it to be any of these Pauls. I'm going to say it it's was Paul McCartney. It's one of these Pauls. Paul McCartney? Hmm? It is, in fact, Paul McCartney. It is? Yes. Paul. Uh, according to his Wikipedia, they got engaged after she became pregnant. Okay. Uh, and then when... She lost the baby. He used that as a. That is the worst thing I've ever heard about Paul McCartney. This is according to his Wikipedia. That better be false on Wikipedia. I would assume if it was false, he would have had. He's got many lawyers. I assume he would have that stricken. <laughs> have you noticed that now he's got a man bun? Does he really? Yeah, I saw a picture of him yesterday, shirtless, and he had a man bun. That's what happens to people who he's do like that thing. He's like 85 years old. Yeah. Wow. Rocking it. You know, when he played uh, Austin City Limits, which is a big music festival, mm -hmm. he was the hottest ticket in town a couple years ago. He opened up the G1C here. Yes, I remember mm -hmm. that. I saw you that day. Maybe. At work? <laughs> Wouldn't me. Oh. No. I didn't go. Somebody was out there with me. Maybe all right. it was George that was... Clooney. <laughs> People get us confused You're all the time. <laughs> You're right. You guys both yeah. use the flow. Mm -hmm. You were George and I was Shakira. Uh, that was Wikipedia. <laughs> Wiki, that was Wiki who, guys. I think that's what we call it. Anyway. Thank you so thing. much. And, and thanks for ending it on a downer like that. We appreciate that, John. All right, stick <laughs> around. we got more in the show coming up.